Ready for the, ready next, for the battle. next battle. battle. Give me everything you've got. Round one. Fight! <laughs>
Get ready for the next battle. Give me everything you've got. Round one. Fight.
Give me everything you've got. Final round. Fight. Top, 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 top
Get ready for the next battle. Give me everything you've got. Round one. Pon up, eh? Guys, enjoy. Got a hit, up. Guys, enjoy. Got a Oh, Bazari. Yeah, do you know? you did miss Christ. Everyone, we're back into it. Sorry, you had to take a little bit of a break. Uh, you know how it is. Commentators need to quench their thirst. And here we are. Alright, so it looks like... Looks like the score is now 2-2 two to two between Dao Tsukundan and Arslan Ash. Get ready for the Hope you guys are having a great time on the stream. Right. If you're enjoying, please do let us know. Support us by following us on Twitter, Instagram, and Twitch. If you like what you see, definitely show your support. Bam. Oh, yeah. Yes. Pain 1009, I am back. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, here comes the Nina. With the rage. And has a lot of headway to make. Oh my goodness. Did just those folks. Damage when you're in rage is just insane. Off kick tonight. Oh. Okay. Denied on the low. Nina goes for the sweep. Oh, watch up with the sidestep. And here comes the JC, and this could be it. No! Gives him the chance. Save tag. JC comes in with the rage now. But this Nina aggression, will he be able to deal with it? Um. What time is it there actually? Right now it's 11.52 over here. Wait. Uh, it is uh, 11.53 over here right now. By the way, guys, is the stream okay now? Uh, you know, sound off in the chat. Uh, let us know, please, if the stream is a lot better. I mean, right now we're doing it at 30 FPS, but at least the bitrate would be a bit better. Please let us know how it is. Oh. Alyssa in the rage. Bam, gets the magic four. Launched up, bam, bam. Uh, oh. In comes the Nina. Oh, the stream is great. All right, thank you so much, Me Kicks. Oh, grabbed and bam and oh, broken. Nice work. Oh, launched up. Unfortunately, Arsalan's got that number, but gets launched in return by the gun there. JC taking him to work. Get, not get the pickup. Oh, unblockable. <laughs> Look at the clock here on the Madden Outdoors, the ornaments of the wall, the stage is so high quality. Yes, this stage is really high quality. Yeah, it's better than before, no more spikes. Alright, great, thank you so much. We we put down the quality to 720 and we took it down to 30 FPS. Uh, that way it's a lot better. So, even though it is going to be a little less in terms of frame rate and resolution, it should still be more a lot more stable. Oh, nice. And speaking of which, the stage is... It's really beautiful, you know, it's wonderful the way that they've managed to play. Even that uh, Tekken 6, even the Tekken 6 that no stage, um, the one where they have the sea outside, that was really good. And they have a floor break, there you are, there's your floor break. <laughs> there's your floor break, and, and the Otsukana comes back. Oh, uh, sorry. Uh, uh, seems there. Yeah. And bam, bam, and to the wall. Oh, wow, that was a weird interaction. Just got pushed in the other direction. Harada, please. Oh, nice. Work. All the way to the wall, man. That's crazy. And the freaking Rana. Magic 4. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, it's not get the hot kick. But it does get the throw grab. Nice bird. JC coming in with the red stuff. Gonna go away in a bit. There we are. That was it. Throw fuss, but you, what you did in this Reaper time break it is really pure fun. I just had something to drink. Uh. Sajawa made something for us to drink and he graciously fed me. So that I believe is a bit to recharge my batteries. Hmm, trust me, you want to keep a commentary going? Get them something to drink. And give them some breaks. Nice optic. And our salon. Yes. Two to three. <laughs> Get ready for the next <laughs> Yo, Silver Fox, nice to see you back. How's everybody doing? Uh, yeah, this is doing great. Thank you so much for asking, man. We're all doing great, having a great time. Uh, yeah, they found out that I have Tekken 6 in this system as well, so they're really excited. And, uh, yeah. You know, we got that stuff, so let's see. Is this a PS3 or an emulator? It is on a native PS3. No emulation over here. What you're seeing is natively run game. Nice. Oh, watch out. Mm -mm. Oh, tech crash. 
Who is on commentary? Sniper yeah. Good Jeff. My name is Silver Fox. I am the commentator for the Pakistani FGC. I am a commentator, not the only one though. Uh, and I'm here commentating for Arsan Ash. Y'all gonna play Tekken 6 one day? Oh man. You know what's funny you should ask? Uh, Sajala asked me if, uh, about it and I said yes, I did have Tekken 6. And we definitely, oh my goodness, wow. And I did say yes, I do have Tekken 6 over here and uh, he's really interested. He wants to be able to play that too. So who knows, we might, uh, maybe not tonight. Who knows, maybe tonight, maybe not, who knows. Good job, bro, keep it up. Thank you so much. I uh, really appreciate the the vote of confidence. We're definitely trying to keep up a good stream over here. Trying to keep everyone entertained. So yeah, Tekken 6 might even come up. If not this week, then definitely next week. So you see, here's the thing. Like, oh, bone and arrow denied, and that is gonna be Daoud Sekunda's own. Oh, and the lip kicks come in. Very good. Nice save over there. So yeah, so what I was trying to, the point that I was trying to make is that, you know, like, with pro players, everyone expects them to perform good in games, but, like, you have to, you know, you, you forget that sometimes they just like to play, they just have fun. Just play games that they like that aren't in circulation anymore. Like, you know, if you talk about Dr. Disrespect, I mean, like, you know, he'd obviously like to play some games other than Warzone that he would have fun with. Uh, but the problem is that, you know, the Warzone audience isn't really going to appreciate it. The good thing about our community is that, you know, a lot of people are really nostalgic for Attack 2. The viewers and the players. And as soon as they found out that, you know, Attack 2 was on the board, they were like, yeah, you know what, let's throw down, let's do it. Let's have some fun. Oh! Most underrated Tekken game. Come on, man. Not underrated at all. This thing was on EVO Grand Finals, man. EVO Main Stage. And <clears throat> definitely a great game. And a lot of love for it. Like, so many people love this game. And it was so busted. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you something. You know what? People... Overhated. Yeah, I'd say that. It, it's kind of. Oh! Oi, 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 oi. Arslan. Good stuff. Okay, here's my belief. Games that have some sort of like busted characters who are, very, you know, characters that are OP, right? Um, they do good in the long run. Like, look at Marvel. It's a phenomenon. Like, everyone loves Marvel. Because they're so hype. When almost everyone is OP. Like, and you know, there's so much imbalance. And you definitely enjoy a lot. <laughs> game had so much personality, more so than canon games. They poured a lot into this game. Their heart and soul went into it. And you can see. No, I'd say the can out of the canon games, I think the one that we've had a lot of effort put into was Tekken 5. Like Tekken 5 themed so beautiful. Oh, smacked. Oh, put on a back three matter. Uh, Dark Resurrection looks amazing to this day on my PS3. Yeah, you know what? That's, that's the beauty of it. That, that game looks really good. Dark Resurrection. It's it's so strange. I mean, like, you know, that game was made for, like, um, a PSP. And when you upscale it, you make it HD and put it on a PS3, it, it just takes it, like, to a whole new level. It looks so clean. In fact, you know what? We have Dark Resurrection here as well. <laughs> it's another thing.
Yes, the Jello in the chat. <laughs> Dark Resurrection is maybe the most loved Tekken game. Yeah, for uh, for Tekken purists, probably the ones that you know that really like have been following Tekken since like the beginning. Competitively, uh, Dark Resurrection was really good. That was the game that first gave us a chance to play Jinpachi. And, you know, he was completely banned. Oh, got her hit. Throw him. Nice. 2 6. Get ready for the next battle. Round one. Mm. Fight. Ooh. Nice work. Good pickup. You see, you see the sort of thing that this game has. I mean, like, it, it's so colorful and it's so nice to be able to see. Uh, uh, forgive me. I mean, like, you know, violent systems is a really great stage in Tekken Seven, but dude, it, it's really boring. Very boring. And I really like the camera angles that they have in Tekken Seven. Like, there's a lot of good stuff there, but oh, they just did not, you know, nice work. They just did not, like, you know, they, the game feels a little bit unpolished in certain ways. Nice work! Oh, Frankensteiner. Lip kicks. Oh, Mina comes in with the sweep. Tries to go for the slaps. Denied. Oh, launched up in the air, though. GC brings up the Elisa. That looks like under in trouble. <laughs> oh, launch. Bam. Delayed hop kick. Goes to the other side. Bam, bam. Mm. Oh, launched up into the air. Tagged out. JC comes in and now comes Nina. And that is it. There we go. Mm, mm. Nice work. Bam, mm, mm. bam, bam. Mm. Oh. Oh my god. What's gonna happen? Oh no. Seeing a lot of luck with Tekken Tag 2 lately on Twitter and YouTube. Yeah, man. Tag 2 is, uh, you know, it, it was a one of a kind game. It was so much fun. It, 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 it was the Tekken that you went to have fun in. Like with Tekken 7, it's it's really serious business, and it's so cool to watch. Tekken 7 is cool, but Tekken Tag 2 was fun. Wall interactions in this game are something else. Really, I hadn't noticed. I did notice that you know you take a lot of damage on that. I really hate the fact that you know I get pushed into the wall and then you know like my my life's a living hell. There it is. Yeah, that's what it is. Pain one, uh, one double oh nine. Uh, attack two is fun. Oh. There we go. They're debating on the frame rate, uh, frame data. They're like, yo, this is twelve, this is thirteen. Was that ten or was that fourteen? So that's what's happening over here. Mm. Oh, first go for the hop kick. Ah, oh, punish for that. Yeah, okay. Mm, mm. One, two. Uh. Oh, taking out of the air. Needs a safe tag. Oh, it does not get it. Final round. Final round for both these guys. Mm -hmm. Nice duck under! But that's a gun that. 
Blocks are low. Mm -hmm. Oh, good stuff. And snake them out of the air. Oh, and now comes the Nina. Very, very scary. Very impressive. Oh, it's like going for the lows. Try to get out her wings, but no dice. These are hands are stopping her. 4 3. Oh, a slight tag it does not work in his favor. It's not actually now we're in a little bit of trouble. No, oh, but nothing he can't handle. Goes for the throw, but denied. Ducks under that. That was a gun there. Oh, does not break that throw this time. And 60 seconds left on the clock. See, 80 seconds, and still we're going into timeouts. The row not broken. Oh, and it's a wall. That's stage transition. Yeah. Five. Four. Lift kicks. Yeah. Oh my goodness. At the very last second. Wow. That was really good. Those are gonna take it. Clip that, please. Good luck to us both. Hmm. So we go right into it once again. Man. Oh, four break. Well, you know, the ground break right over there. Right in the beginning of the stage. Oh, hit. Take it so far away, my goodness. Axel. Attack crash comes in. Chainsaw's out. Oh no. Yeah, Nina gets the counter hit. Now she's gonna go in. Oh, does not get that. Conversion. Nice counter hit. Yep. And in comes the Jay Z. And into the wall. Bam, bam. Eh, eh. Oh, launched up. And that is gonna be it. Bam. Man, how these guys do it is beyond me. That's crazy. What a sidewalk. <laughs> yeah, man, I know. That's what it is. Z, JDCR, and uh, me, and Sane. All these guys, they might have been real champs, but yes, we were there as well. If uh, Pakistan had had ch a chance before, we would have actually completely destroyed them in this game as well. Uh, Lord0761. Yes, this is on the PS3. No throw break. Mm -mm. Nice work. Gets the grab. No follow up. Oh, nice launch. And JC's coming in. Mm. Rage used. Taken down. Good stuff. Going back to the dance of Chikoritas. Do you have the DLCs? All of them. We've got all the DLCs. So you can definitely see Unknown. You can see Sebastian. You can see Force Law. And Michelle Kang. Oh. Ikimas. And Baskanovich. Or as he's known, Tekken Tag 2, Baskanovich. But if you play Tag 3, he's always. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Man. Rosekunder has a lot of work to do if he wants to take down this Nina, but she is... Oh, there you go. That parry takes him down. That's what's scary about this character, man. She's just so oppressive. Like, you are you can even be scared to press buttons against her. Even more so against the Jun, because the Jun Get is just out of this blast, world. Blast, blast. Also, Tag 2 gave us a lot of free content. Yes! Yes, it did. And that was beautiful. That was so nice of Harada. 
to be able to put everyone on an equal footing because they really wanted this game to be you know uh, to have a good um competitive scene so they try to make everyone on equal footing but now what it is it's all about dlc it's all about releasing those characters as paid content and you know and making them busted as hell like the case with leroy and fuck and even the last, the very last DLC character that they brought out in Lividia Sobieska, one of the best characters in the game. Damn, take it down. So, Namco Bandai, when they release their DLCs, obviously they want them to sell well. And to be able to sell well, they have to release them to be very broken, very OP. Otherwise, people will not buy them. That is what their philosophy is. But if you bring out fan favorites like, you know, Lei Wu Long or Kunimitsu, um, even if they are not that high up in the tier list and not picked by a lot of people, they still suck. Leroy's design, I mean, everything up until the Leroy launch was great. And then when he launched, everyone was like, what is this guy? Why? Why is he doing this? Nice sidewalk. Oh, bam! Blown up. Oh, surprise look on Anina's face. What the hell just happened? What? Did this this girl? She just gave me her head? What? <laughs> oh. 15 seconds left on the clock. A launch. Good opportunity. Let's see what goes. Oh, no. No pickup. And Cat Crash comes in. Bow and arrow. Oh no, five seconds. Oh, it's currently in the one second favor. And there he is. He takes it down with the patience. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Alright. <laughs> Which Julia is lose? Your guess is as good as mine. There we go. Four, three, and bam! Big damage with rage. And our JC comes in with rage of her own, and it's gonna outlast the Alyssa. But will it make any difference? That's the question. Bam! Smacked in with the ass. Bam. Bone arrow and slam. Booty smash. Oh no! And there it is. Man, I really gotta learn this game. <clears throat> Drop kick. Two. Oh, nice work. Launch shot. Good stuff. This is it. Perfect. Seven golden letters. Daoud Sekunder gets them and takes it to the final round. See, that's how that's how cool this game is. I mean, like, you know, you, you you can just like be down before you even know it. Eh, 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 eh. Oh no, this is that. Yes, once again, who, who, who's Julia is who's will have to play the guessing game. Oh, not anymore. Alyssa comes in now. Oh, slight. No punishment over there. That was a gun there. You really need to get those punishments out. Hmm. Oh, nice! The slide just sways back. Oh, nice. Sidestepping that slide and taking full advantage of that. But the attack crash comes out. Bow and arrow in answer. Also, Gunner has rage, so he's gonna be using it. But no, that launch is gonna put him down. And by the time he gets up, obviously, rage is gone. Oh, both trying to go for bow and arrow again at the same time. Oh, there you go. And bam, the butt stomp. Gives the round to Arslan Ash. Three to eight. Get ready for the next battle. Get Mm. Right. Nice. Yeah. Launched him. Yeah. 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 
Oh, yeah. oh nice counter hit. Mm. Ah, counter. Oh no. He better switch. He's gonna come for a track crash, obviously. There we go. And stage transition. Oh, does not get the last hit on that. And oh launched. Bam bam bam. Oh so far away. Oh nice work. By the Hotsukunda. Gets the save tag over there and the top kick to close it out with the robot girl. And now we're back to Miss Lucha Libre. Crushed under the unblockable tackle. Yep. Oh, launched knife work, but no capitalization. Nice stop on that move with the crouch out, but oh crap. Here comes our salon. He's not gonna take that standing out. Bam, 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 bam. What's the mix up? Oh. Bam. Oh, uh, uh. Bam. And switch. Launch up. Uh, who are the best characters in the world? Ladizo. Ladizo. Thank you so much for joining us. Welcome to the chat. Welcome to the stream, man. Uh, who are the best characters in this game? Well, it depends. I mean, like, you know, whoever's your favorite is the best. Uh, according to tiers, uh, you know, tier lists, Heihachi is, like, right at the top. Yeah, Heihachi is one of the best characters in this game. Um, and uh, Jinpachi is also there up with him. Bob Richards is also very good. Smart by Arsalan, he's not tagging Salty to avoid giving him rage. That is good. Yeah, that is actually true. Because obviously, if he gets rage, you know, he can actually uh, tech crash it. Uh, Jimmy Q, welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for joining us, man. Thank you so much for chatting for the first time. Hey, guys, do you know when does Texas Showdown full start? Yeah. Ah, flew away. Armor King? Yeah, Armor King is a very good character as well. One of the top tiers in this game. Uh, Texas Showdown... Texas Showdown, I believe, uh, I'm not sure entirely. We're not really there. We're not going. So you'll have to check the website and check the socials to be able to know. Oh, launched up. We're going to see Tekken Cross Street Fighter 2. Um, no, that game is more or less dead in the water. Uh, Harada has unofficially confirmed it. Nice, taken down. So Dalsagunda gets that last game, making it 4-8. Right. Uh, so Tekken Cross Street Fighter, unofficially taken down. Oh, the gorilla, the spinning gorilla. Nice. <laughs> yeah, that's fun to watch. Now we're going to see Tekken Cross Street Fighter 2. Man, um... Okay, so our boys do not know how to play Street Fighter Cross Tekken. And they're probably not going to be interested in that because they don't have a lot of nostalgia with the game. This game, they do. Um, and Tekken Cross Street Fighter, that's never happening, sadly. Uh, like I mentioned, Harada has confirmed, unofficially confirmed it, that the game has been canned. So, sadly, nothing. I think... The only thing that we, the, as, you know, the only thing that is close to Tekken Cross Street Fighter that we've seen uh, is uh, Akuma in Tekken 7, and that's it. That's what they salvaged. Because I do remember that they had, uh, they were working on models and uh, some moves. They had implemented the Hadouken in uh, Tekken at that time. And to salvage the project, they just made a lot, and that's it. Oh, nice. To salvage the project, they just made Akuma and they put him in Tek Tekken 7, and then that's it. That's what it is. Yeah, man. What a comeback. Yeah, absolutely, man. That's crazy. Oh, to the other side is the booty bump. Damn, nice tack throw. Takes away all that red luck. Kick, and the tack crack comes out. 
Yeah. Alright, nice block on the low. Low parry, good stuff. He knew that was coming in, but he doesn't get it to complete. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Third so slide just gave it to him, I believe. Mm -hmm. Guys, look at look at the game, man. It's on point. Nice, and it picks up. Yeah, yeah. Up the command was crazy. Those is playing solo right now. He is. Oh no! Black smash does not work. But he gets taken down anyways. So Tekken 8, Tekken 7 Julia, you're seeing her on screen right now where she came from and you know, even with JC she was just like, wow, what is this character man? By the way, I only just realized after like, you know, seeing her in Tag 2 as JC, uh, Julia has some long, a, some pretty long legs. But she's, she's tall. Raid? That's what I mean. Uh, not right now, but uh, when we do sign off, maybe we, we might raid someone. And we'd love to see who that will be. Launched up with the lift kicks, and out comes. Oh no, that tag assault did not work in our son's favor, but well, he's definitely making other things work right now. Nice tag crack, tag nice. right over there. But oh no, and the tag assault comes out, but again, no pickup, and the lift kicks. Is he coming? Eh, eh, eh. He might not get a lot of damage, but definitely enough. Oh, this could be it. Bam, and that is it. The ulti gun there goes five to eight against Ursula and Ash. Get ready for the next battle. Round one. Fight. What a clutch. Oh man, what a clutch indeed. Dalit's gonna blink so well right now. Oh, the tag does not do him any favors. Oh, nice low parry. And Nina's in rage, but oh, gets hit on the low. Finally picked him up, but now rage is gone now. Damn, damn, damn. Into the wall. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, nice work. And Tech Crash comes in. Nice duck under. Oh, I think he went for the low kick over there. The, the lift kicks over there, but didn't work. Oh, bam, bam, that is it. Nina gets it. Nice bow and arrow, and he rushes in. Low parry, good stuff by the Julia. Oh, lift kicks once again. And this time on the other side. And, oh, slaps, oh. Oh, gets. Wow. What is that throw? I've never seen that. Man. Man, I really need to practice more with Nina. Oh, there you go. The Lucha Libre style. And Tack Trash comes in. But in the back. No. 
One on four. The lip picks. Wow. Oh my god. Is this gonna be it? This is probably gonna be it, isn't it? Oh my goodness. Dao Sekunder, what an amazing, amazing victory. Flushing it out. Getting that lucky launch. Bam! Taking that. Mmm. Hit the wall. Chuckleman TV! Welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for joining in. Thank you so much for your message. Hello to you too. Uh so Jimmy Raku. Tag 2 is so fun to watch. I wish it was released on PC. Me too, man. It would have been so butter smooth if it was running on PC. And you know, just imagine the mods. Imagine the mods coming after this game. Oh, watch. Yep, yep, yeah. Man, you could like turn the uh you could turn ancient ogre into the predator or something like that, and that would be so cool. Are they playing now? Uh yeah, they are actually playing right now. Uh, if you're, if you're talking about our boys, that is... Oh, smash in the butt. Uh, the amount of content in this game is insane. Wish it had balancing like Tekken 7. Dude, that would have been impossible because... Have you seen the roster in this game? Man, there's like 60 characters. Balancing them all would have been a nightmare. It would have been so difficult. Lip kicks. Mm, 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 mm. This is the largest roster in all Tekken history. And you can't, you, you logistically, I don't simply can't balance so many characters because, you know, it's, yeah, is tag to balance bad? Yeah, it kind of is. Because you have to understand that, you know, the, sh the smaller your roster is, the, m you know, the more chances it has of being better balanced. Um, yeah. And I know by that by that logic, you know, like Street Fighter 1 is the most balanced game in the world. Ah, there we go. Arslan gets it. 5-9. So, like I said, Street Fighter 5 would have been like the most balanced game in the world. But not entirely true. Um, Get ready for but you can definitely say Street Fighter 2 is a lot more balanced. Um, yeah. With so many characters, you know, you have to see who's going to work, who's going to be good against whom, and who's going to be bad against whom. So, there's no definitive answer, and it's going to be, you know, like, always up in the air. It's going to be, well, someone's always going to be, like, up uh, out with the sort of resources that these guys have. I mean, it's not a MOBA. Yeah, it's not League of Legends, it's not Dota. So, it's a little difficult to balance. Mm, it was really crowded, so they had a bad time balancing everyone, but it was fun. That's true, yeah. But they had a really bad time balancing everyone, which is why you have, you know, lots of crazy people, you know, like, playing weird characters. Like, Anakin's always gonna play his, uh, Jax. Like, Prototype Jack, arguably the worst character in this game. Oh, nice work, Arsalan, but gets a break. Oh, nice catch. Damn, good read on that, duck that floor, and there it is. So like I was saying, Prototype Jack, worst character in this game. Stubby punches, uh, you know, very, very difficult to play, very slow. And uh, Prototype Jack has been done dirty too many times at this point. That's the thing, that's the thing, he's a prototype. He's not supposed to be good. He's a prototype, he's still, he, he's supposed to be the shitty version. Oh. Oh, kind of hit. Nice work. Oh, good stuff. Not letting him stand up. Oh, oh, oh. Bam, bam. Nice work. Taken down. Yeah, so. So, Prototype Jack is not supposed to be good. Jack 6, on the other hand, is a beast. No. Now it's in the coldest robot gun jack though. Gun jack is where it all started getting good, baby. Like, well, not really. I mean, like, but that's where you know that's where he, they started bringing in that whole futuristic aspect, like whole circle. Yeah. Yeah. Jack or P Jack? I like P Jack. Very good game. Very good. 
वो यार उसका कुछ पहुंचता ही नहीं है सारा कुछ जो है वो उसका इतना मठा है वो शो पीस ही रखा हुआ वो आने के नहीं बस चलाया था बस और वो भी जो ना वो बुला के उसका काम ही अब थ्री अब वन टू तो अब वन टू था ना तो वो बोलती है ना पीजे के मार्फ़ टेक इट सम बाय द वे नो प्लीज डोंट लेट दिस क्रैप एंड डोंट डू इट प्लीज डोंट ब्रिंग पीजे के सकेज इट टू टेक इट सम बाय यार मलिक आज खेल लेगा वो हमारा है लेकिन I was about to say Brian, but then I remembered he's a cyborg. Yeah, Brian is a cyborg. And Yoshimitsu, I don't even know what Yoshimitsu is. It is he a human? Is he a robot? What what is he? And there it is, Arslan. Ten, two, five. Two more, Arslan. Yeah, boogie, yeah.